Hello, Super Video Man 000 here, and this is another video by Super Video Man 000. And today I'm going to be showing you how to rip Blu rays slash DVDs. What you're going to need is software called Make MKV, it's in beta right now, and you're going to need Handbrake. Okay, so um, links for those will be in the description, and here we go. So, actually, I'm going to show you. Um, video. After um, ripping and then um, compressing the size, um, the size of Despicable Me was about three gigabytes, and the size of Diary of the Kid was about 11 gigabytes. So it's going to be smaller than the 25 gigabytes that a normal Blu-ray disc is, but it's still going to be pretty big. Okay, so um, what you need to do is first insert your disc and dolphin tail. Don't ask why. Um, I don't even know. I just found it in my stairs. And insert it into your Blu-ray player. I'm just gonna put away this disc. Okay. It's done. And now power DVD, of course, opened. Um out of that. Okay, now open make MKV. It's gonna scan. Then you're going to want to click on this um, Blu-ray disk drive type thing. Click on that. And wait a little while. This is actually not... I, I'm not sure. It's like it's in beta, so you'd think it would be free, but it's not. So, okay, so you see, um, yeah, so it's like 29 days, but I think, I think it's free. I'm not exactly 100% sure about that. Okay, so there's this one that says, Dalvin Dale, 12 chapters, 26.4 gigabytes. And you can just uncheck all these ones. These are going to be like your added on content and your commercials and stuff in front of the thing. Okay, now, uncheck everything you don't want, unless you want, like, if you want subtitles, then just click on it, but no one wants subtitles. And you don't have to click on that if you don't want to. I'll just do it. Okay, so, what you want is not this audio, DTS HD Lossless English, but you want DTS 3 slash two um, plus one English that's the better size and then make note of this um, output folder and click make MKV and click yes to create the folder okay I'll meet you when this is done okay and now it is done with the make MKV portion okay and just close out of this um, okay, so, now this file, I'm just gonna view in details, is 22 gigabytes, and now what we do is open up Handbrake, source, open file, media, video, dolphin tail, click on that, open that. Now click on MKV. Then what you can do is in the video, my to be H.264. That's the good one. Then okay, so this is what this is the thing. Okay. Zero is lossless, which means it'll be exactly the same. Or pretty much the video quality will be exactly the same. Um, 
51 is like horrible. You can actually preview it. I'll show you. And load, load, load. See, it's horrible. And you can show, uh, and you can preview it being good. Like, it's uh, if you roll your finger over it, it says that you should do. Uh, it says you should do um, 18 to 20 for standard def, and 20 to um, 20 to uh, 23 for high def. So I'm going to do 20. I'm just gonna click start. Oh, destiny. Actually, I'm gonna show you one more thing. You can move this down to um 1280. Okay, you can change this down to like um twelve eighty seven twenty. Um but I'm just gonna keep it at 1920 by 1080. And yeah. Um get 20 is on that. And set the destination as MJV. Click on that. That T000. And just call it pressed just click on start and this should take a while like it's um yeah it'll take a while and when you're done you should install a codec pack what's it called shark um, Shark 007, and if you have the 64-bit um, Windows, which basically everyone has, you'll need the 60-64-bit the 60, 60, uh, settings application. Wait, just download that from Shark 007, and then you'll be able to play it in Movie Maker, or Movie Maker, uh, media player and media center and it should work as you can see the compressed movie is about five and a half gigabytes I'll see you in the next video